The seven day kickstart program has been designed to ignite fat loss, to prime your body to be able to kickstart you into results. Being able to get your body to reboot, and this is where so many people get stuck. They're not even able to get their body to be able to get the fat burning process started and accelerated. But what we wanna be able to do now is that you've got that program. You're being able to use it, and you're being able to see the effects with your own body from day to day, and at the end of it as well. What we need to do now is what happens after this. And this is so important because you can't follow the seven day kickstart program for longer. It's made to be seven days. It's been designed this way for specific reasons. And this is so we can get your body resensitizing it to the hormone insulin. So you can be able to use carbs to fuel fat loss later and avoid fat gain. Also being able to get you to use the right workouts, the smart workouts, so you're able to get results faster as energy consumption is increased for up to 24 hours after every workout. Let me give you a real life example as to how and why you need to make your own plan unique to you. Now, as you might know, having a new baby is fantastic and there's plenty of fun with it, but it comes with a few side effects. And one of them is some low sleep. Also comes with that with some high stress levels. And this can easily come about from having to wake often throughout the night. Now, because of this, my body was under different stimulus. It was under a different stress, and my training and nutrition had to change for that. And this is how you can go through times like this in your life to be able to stay in shape and not have to turn your life upside down to make that happen. A couple of those changes that needed to happen is actually eating more carbohydrates and lowering the training volume and frequency to be able to dictate and work with the stress happening. And I know this can be totally opposite to what you're hearing everything else out there. But this is why and why I wanted to use this example as to what you need to be able to do to be able to get your body into the shape that you want. That is made to what's going on in your life. Another example of changes that need to happen are with females and going through the menstrual cycle. This is where in the two different phases, the luteal and the follicle phases, training and nutrition can actually change to these. Changes in your carbohydrate intake and training style and frequency can easily match to what's going on in a hormonal state with the body going through that change. And for the guys, I know so many of you, as the clients, numerous from all over the world, have gone through these problems, but then are able to get in great shape. You find a spot you can't do, you can't get the results like you have before. You might be getting a little bit older, and this might be because your hormones are changing. Testosterone can be at the culprit of this, and this is what we need to be doing to be able to increase naturally your testosterone so you get the results that you want. So whether you're having a new baby, whether you're going through your menstrual cycle, or whether your testosterone is dropping, all these things I'm trying to show you right now, the key and importance to your hormones and why we have to match things to your plan. And this is why in the next episode, I'm gonna show you some of the secret sauce to getting in and staying in great shape. I'm giving you some of my key points that I've learned from over 10 years of transforming bodies around the world. You are not gonna to wanna to miss this one because this one is not what most people are commonly going for. Now, if you want the seven day Kickstart program, you're in good luck. Click the link below and get exclusive free access to it. Let me send everything through for you, plus give you the insider tips that only people that sign up for this program get access for. I'll see you on the inside and I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next episode.